Hi, welcome to our IELTS Coffee Time programme. This is where we give you hints and tips about how to succeed in your IELTS exam. This is session number two, so we're dealing with speaking test part two today. Here, the examiner will give you a card with some questions on it, and you're given one minute to prepare. It says in the instructions that you can make notes, and it's my advice that you should do so. A good way to make notes is to prepare a mind map for yourself. Here's an example of the set of questions that you might be given. This one's about exercise. And here's an example of a quick mind map that I made to remind me of all the points that I should make while I'm talking. I live in Finland, so this is about my life in Finland. In it, I've got different sections for the different questions so that I know that I hit all the points that are being asked of me. I also give the main things that I want to say for each of those points. You haven't got time in your minutes preparation time to write sentences. So you're going to need to just make it bullet points, but connect the words together. And that's why it's called a mind map. When you're speaking, you'll sound more natural anyway if you produce the sentences there and then. The examiner will be looking for you to speak with fluency, accuracy, and they'll also be assessing your pronunciation. So now it's time to start thinking about how do you speak? How are words that we commonly use pronounced? You can find hints on this by looking at the internet. There are an awful lot of programs out there available to help you videos to watch, but you can also so. listen to native speakers talking, listen to how they link words together and link sentences together. Take those on board and start to put those into your everyday usage. So now when somebody asks you, what are you doing? Are you watching TV again? Why are you wasting your time? You can legitimately say, no, no, I'm listening to their accent. I'm practicing for my IELTS exam. Honest I am.